Well, if it's a, a residential property, prob probably 10%, right? Say, say 10%, yeah. all right? But the interest rate is prob probably going to be quite high, yes or no, all right? If you want to get a buy to that mortgage, it'll be 25%. Should we just say 20% for now? So that's a good safety zone. So what it means is, unless you've got 20% deposit, you're not really going to be able to afford to buy a property, yes or no? Right, so what is the average house price in the UK at the moment? Well, you know, forget about London, you know, you're talking about a lot. So what, what, what's the average nationwide? 300, let's say 200, shall we? I'm sure you can find somewhere in the Midlands for 200. In fact, my driver told me that his uh, sister-in-law just bought a five bedroom house in Bradford for 60 grand. I don't, didn't ask him what condition he was in, <laughs> but yeah, too good to be true. Okay, so let's say 200,000. So what that means is, what's 20% of 200,000? 40 grand, right? So raise your hand, you've got 40 grand cash right now? All right. Quite a number of you. Both of you think, oh, really? That's the end of it. So I won't go home now, catch my next train. You know what? That's okay. It's okay. I'll tell you what you should do, because everyone can tell you the same, is that you need to start saving money. Alright? You just need to start saving. So the question is, how much do you save on a monthly basis? Most people go. <laughs> I, I don't know, I've, I've been doing this survey for quite a long time to be interesting and I think it would be very optimistic for me to say that people would even put aside 200 pounds a month. Oh you do? Oh you do, great! You have to, and is that what you do? You save for a deposit? Yeah, how long have you been saving now? Not that long, so you just started the 200, 200 pounds a month? Good, right, so let's do some stuff to show you. 200 pounds a month in a year? How much do you save in a year? 2,400 pounds a year. All right? And so how many times would that go into 40 grand? Come on, someone help me out here. I'm not really that good at that. How, how many years? 15 years. All right, okay, that's fine. Save more, right? Save 400 pounds, double that to 4,800, all right? So that means, now it's looking more real estate. So you've been less than, let's say eight years. All right, eight years, you saved enough money. How long does it take for UK house prices to double in value? According to, re according to statistics of the past 50 years, taking the average, forget about the last few years, it takes on average 7.3 years to double in value. So 7.3 eight years later, you save the money for the deposit. What happens to the house price? It would double in value, right? Yes or no? Yeah. So that means the saving strategy is what they all tell you to do, but it sucks. Because it simply does not work. Yes or no? Yeah. Time passing experience say that's not how it's done. 